Okay, in this video, I'm going to run two benchmarks on the Nexus 7 tablet. So let's get to it. Now, in my previous video, I ran two benchmarks on this device, and in this video, we're going to finish it up with two more. So I have a folder here with my benchmarking apps. So let's try out Nenemark 2. Now this one is a landscape benchmark app, and let's run it. All right, the device runs at a solid 55 frames per second. Let's go back to the home screen here and finish this up with the final benchmark, which is Velamo. All right, I'm going to accept this EULA here, and it says, would you like to edit the list of websites Velamo accesses? I don't really care, so I'm going to hit no, and I want to start up the benchmark here. And then it says, enable tutorial. Sure, why not? I mean, I've run this before, but not on this device, but if you're new to it, it'll give you an idea of what's going on. Now, this is a rendering test, and it says tests the performance of HTML5 Canvas based on graphics. So let's hit OK, and this is an HTML5 test. It gives you a butterfly here, and I believe a lot of these are graphical tests here. And this is test 1 of 11, See the Sun Canvas. Okay, the second test here is rendering, tests the performance of HTML5 canvas based graphics. So hit OK and you get a spinning shark there. And this is test two, which was C canvas. This is test number three, which is aquarium canvas. And it says rendering. With many simultaneous objects, this stresses the performance of both the HTML5 canvas based graphics and the JavaScript engine. Hit OK. And here we go. You get a lot of objects moving at the same time. Okay, test 4 of 11, Pixel Blender. And another rendering test. Measures the web graphics related bandwidth available for blitting and bending operations. Let's hit OK. And here we go. Test 5 of 11, Surf Wax Binder. And this is a JavaScript test. Test the array performance of the browser's bindings between the browser and JavaScript engine. Test 6 of 11, SunSpider Online, and another JavaScript test. Measures JavaScript performance using Rev 0.9.1 of the industry standard SunSpider suite. And here we go. Test 7 of 11, V8 Benchmark Online. Another JavaScript test measures JavaScript performance using Rev 6 of the industry standard V8 Benchmark suite. And here we go. Test 8 of 11, Ocean Flinger, user experience. This is a test that tests scrolling smoothness and performance using a demo news site.
test 9 of 11, Image Flinger. This is a user experience test. It says stress tests the browser scroll performance when using a page made up of dense images. Might take a moment to load. So let's click OK on that. User experience test 10 of 11, Text Flinger. Stress tests the browser scroll performance when using a text-heavy web page. May take a minute to load. Okay, test 11 of 11, coming into the home stretch here. Networking loader. Networking repeatedly loads and reloads a sample web page to determine HTTP networking stack performance. This happens quickly and hence you may only see the base color background. And we're done. We have a Velamo score of 1647. It says Velamo sings 1647 as your score. And then if I want to compare this to other devices, just hit yes. And it's generating a comparison here. And this is pretty small, so I don't know if you're going to be able to see it. But my device is second on the list here. And top of the list on this list, at least, is the HTC One XL device. So that pretty much does it for this video. If you have any questions or comments, please post them down below. If you like what you see, please subscribe. And if you want to help out my channel, give me a thumbs up or favorite this video. As I mentioned in my previous video, if you want to see how this device stacks up against your device, all you need to do is go to Google Play, download these benchmarking apps, and run it on your device, and then you can see how your score compares to this score. And if you want to see how previous devices that I've reviewed stack up against the Nexus 7, just check the archives on my channel page. So thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.